So this was a referral from Mark Hyman and John Hopkins. Um, we do get other patients that kind of been around the block. Like so I said, you can't say Lyme's just yet, but Lyme's just they've been around the block. Uh, excessive severe unrelenting hives, histamine, itchy skin. Oh, this is a really cool one. This is not that long. Itchy skin, hypothyroid, Lyme disease diagnosis, resolved. Not that it wasn't. Well, it was, but it was not. <coughs> Did heavy medical chelation using high doses of antihistamine. Doesn't like the side effects, wants more of a natural approach. Medic medicines only are min minimal and temporary help. No diet restrictions, which I question drastically. Supplementation was 100 milligrams twice a day, of course, and 200 milligrams of vitamin C, which I think is certainly not enough. And she takes Claritin and Levo, but Claritin only helped calm down temporarily. Chelation helped, but only had she was having a reactivity in hives. I ordered the MDL, sorry I wasn't back yet, so I just wanted to see if she still had Lyme, or if it was resolved. Those were her presenting stuff, everything was really negative, except for, this was just last week. Um, so her ESR was normal, but her Lyme disease back then was actually normal, or yeah, normal level, but that's, we all know what that can happen like. She was fasting, so her glucose is certainly a little high. Everything else looked good. Her immunoglobulins were good, so she has immune competence. And look at her serum triplets. This was, a, I, I couldn't believe I caught it. Like, Holy cow, I caught a triplet. You barely ever see these. And I'm like, you have mass cell activation. And so we put her on like a 2,000 milligrams of quercetin and, you know, put her on, those, put her on the probiotics. I'm going to put this stuff I put her on here. Look at her cow's milk allergy. Less than two is normal, less than four. About four is, oh my gosh, she's at 70. <laughs> I think she should drink milk if she's got a mass activation of histamine response. Gluten's at 7.4, so that's bad. So we took her off of all those, and she's done a little work. I blocked some, I put her on the probiotics, we did a little bit of mass cell, quercetin, calmed her diet down, and she's still taking her flares and all that stuff. She's doing phenomenally well already, and I haven't even gotten back to the line and stuff. So 